Okay, you guys. Um, I definitely understand if you guys are thinking like, this is such an old office product. Why are you even talking about this? Well, because I just ran into a client that was using an older version of Office 2003 and 2007, and they were trying to save things with PDFs, and they had no save option, and they were freaking out. So I figured I would create this video to maybe there's another company out there that's having the same issue. Uh, so this is uh, to show you in 2003, 2007, and 2010 Office products to how to save as a, a PDF. Now in 2010, that option's already in there, but I'll just show you how to use it. Uh, for 2003, we're just going to go ahead and open up that 2003 document. Now unfortunately, I haven't found Microsoft, because there's uh, for the older versions, 2003 and 2007, they had these add-ons. Um, they created it for 2007, but I couldn't find it for 2003. So for 2003, how I solved it was I just installed a third-party utility called uh, Qt Writer, which is uh, their Qt PDF Writer. Um, you can go to their website. Uh, if you just Google Qt uh, PDF, you can find it, or the link in the description will have that. Um, also, for 2007, you will need this one. This is the um, one that actually Microsoft created for 2007 uh, Office. So you would need this installed. But now we're just going to be working with 2003, so let's just get this installed, which we already ran the installation. Um, and it should pop up. Yeah, I see it's already installed. So you just install it. It's just a quick, quick next, next, next install. Once you install it, you're going to notice in your devices and printers that you have an option called Qt PDF Writer. Now for this, this is how we're going to save uh, Word to PDFs. So once you see that in there, now if you see Microsoft Print to PDF, then you can use that too. Um, but if you don't have any kind of PDF option, you can install it as a feature for Windows 10, or you can install a third-party utility called Qt PDF Writer. So you have those options. Now I'm just going to show you the Qt PDF Writer in this video. So I went into Word, created a new document. We're going to go to File, Print. We're not going to actually print the document. We're just going to use that third-party Qt PDF Writer, and I can I'm going to show you what it's going to do. So we're going to select that uh, printer. I guess you could call it. Hit OK. And it should pop up and ask us to save this as a PDF here in a minute. And there you have it. So now uh, it's acting like a printer, but it's not a printer. Um, so we can now click our desktop. We can say this is our test PDF. And our save type is PDF. That's fine. Hit save. And then we can go ahead and close out of here. And now we have a PDF on our d uh, desktop that says this is our test PDF. Go ahead and open it, make sure it saved everything right, and there you have it. So that's how you can save a Word document in 2003 as a PDF. That's the only thing that I found for that older version of Office. So let's go and close out of here. Now for 2007, I do not have that Office uh, installed, but I've done it many times. You just This is uh, going to be another download in the description of this video. And you just download this, install it, and this is verified by Microsoft. It is a Microsoft written uh, add-on. As you can see, uh, Microsoft save as PDF or XPS in 2007 Office. So once you install this on your computer, when you open up your Word document and you go to File, Save As, you will have that drop-down to save as a PDF. So you will have that option in that drop-down. Or if you don't want to install this, you can actually install QD PDF and that'll do exactly what we just did in the 2003, uh, 2010, 2007, any version of Office it'll work for. 10, so I can show you how to do it. Now with Word, it's already built in, so you don't have to install any of those things that I just did. You can just, we'll just do test, and we can do save as, and now we have this drop down for PDF. So go ahead and select that and hit save. I love how they have that feature already built in in 2010 and the latest versions of Office, 2013, 2016, and so on. Um, Office 365 has that. So there you guys have it. So if you don't have a way to save as a PDF, you can use QD Writer for any version of Office. But just so you know, Office 2010 and on, I already have that feature built in. If you're working with Office 2007, you can install this add-on. And these links will be in the description of this video for you guys. All right, hope this was helpful. Thanks, guys. See you in the next video.